Hello guys. So recently I received uh, several requests on how did I achieve uh, the Spider-Verse animations. So this tutorial is about uh, this topic. All you need to have is the source file of your animation. Sometimes uh, if your animation comes from the marketplace, you don't have it. So I'm going to show you the whole pipeline to achieve your source file and then to achieve the uh, Spider-Verse animation. So if I launch the game, right now you may see that I have two different animations duplicated and they look the same. So first of all, how you can get your source file. Uh, select the animations, press right mouse button and then go to the asset actions. Use export and simply store it to your uh, directory. Now open up your animation, like this and this. Uh, you may see that by default frame rate here looks a little bit different from the one that you used to uh, used to see. So it's not 30 frames. So let's first of all uh, deal with this one. And uh, this issue uh, often comes with the Mixamo animations. Uh, scroll down to the input settings of your animation and select custom sample rate to 30. Now select the source file and link to the one that you exported uh, earlier. Press re-input animation. Now you'll see that the frame rate is normalized sort of to the one that you uh, know, 30 frames. And if you launch the game, you may see that uh, animation is uh, fixed, uh, nothing is broken, so uh, we can move on. Also, let's do this for the one that we have here. It's also sort of broken. Nice. So here comes the tricky part about the Spider-Verse animation. By default, the frame rate of those animations are 12. So we need to do the following. Select the rate scale to 0.4. So if we multiply 0.4 by 30, you will get those uh, required 12 frames. Next, in the interpolation, we go from the linear to step to get this sluggish style. And all you need to do here, use the custom sample rate to 12. And if your animation is failed to re-input, select the snap to close this frame bound checkbox. Now simply re-input your animation and you will see that you have this sort of Spider-Verse animation, which is also normalized to the frame rate of 30. Let's do the same for the one that's left. Now, if I launch the game, you may see that we have the difference. Those animations look uh, much more stylized and probably the result that you want to achieve. So, as this being said, this tutorial is done, hopefully you like it, and uh, as always guys, please subscribe to my channel, leave your feedback, and I do have Patreon page, so you may always support me if you like, the link is under this video, and see you soon guys.